Hello everyone, this is the second video of day 12 of 365 days aptitude challenge and today we are going to deal with some of the concepts of LCM and HCF. Now LCM and HCF it seems to be very easy. Okay, of course it is easy only but there are kind of questions which are given in LCM and HCF which can make this topic difficult. Okay, so there is a little bit of awareness which is needed. There are little bit of concepts which you need to learn and some of the logic which you have to apply. Okay, do teen cheese aapko yaad bhi rakhna padega definitely. Okay, so uh, that along with the concepts would work very well for you guys. Okay, so let's see how it goes for us. Okay, uh, in this video, we are not going for a very advanced uh, what you say questions of LCM at HCF, but we will start with a very basic, uh, but then we will see that within two or three videos, we are able to solve advanced problems of LCM and HCF. Remember, LCM and HCF is not a very easy topic. Okay, it's not easy, but if you are able to what you say work on it, okay, difficult to be. Alright, so don't underestimate or don't uh, get discouraged. Okay, so that's how it should be. Alright, guys. So if I am dealing with the questions of LCM and HCF, and if I ask you what is the LCM of 32 and another number, let's say 46. Okay, so what you will do is up log generally ye karoge, which is 2, and you will write it as 16, and here this is 23. Okay. Now this anyways, I got a prime number, right? So I would say the LCM would be 2 into 16 into 23. Correct. Okay. Uh, let's let me take another one. Okay. Let's say I am talking about 30. Okay. And let's say I'm talking about uh, 100 and 140. Okay. Let's see. So if I take this as 15 and this one as 70, okay, so abhi... now anyways, there are no common ones which can divide these two, right? 5 se to divide hoga, sorry, 5 se divide hoga, so 3 into this will be 14, okay? Now, yahan pe ek prime number a gaya anyways, so I can say it is 2 into 5 into 3 into 14, that should be the LCM of this particular number, okay? Now, uh, there is another method also in which we can do LCM, okay, which we should learn basically. Because we don't have to waste time waste, karne ke liye rehta, okay. See, first thing, we have to learn this, then it will be a bit And not necessarily we will get the answer in two steps, okay. Sometimes it would take more number of steps. So what we are supposed to do is, let's say, there is a question given. We have to take three numbers. Le lete. Let's say there is a question given 12, 16 and 24. Okay, something like that. Okay. Now what I will do is in these three uh, numbers, if I am taking an LCM, okay, in these three numbers, I will see which one is the highest. Okay, this is the highest. Now I'll, I will see if this number is able to divide these two or uh, what you say, if these two are the factor. Okay, wo chodo just to see if this number is able to divide these two completely okay it is able to divide this one but not this one so what you will do is multiply this one by 2 24 into 2 will become 48 see if this one is able to divide this now okay anyways this was divided multiply by 2 karenge to definitely hoga. now is this able to divide this yes this is able to divide this so i can say 48 is the lcm Okay, so that is another method in which you can solve this one, right? Okay, so let me take another example. Let's say I am taking an example which is 64, okay, and 96. I want to take the LCM of these two. So, I have always the option that I can just say that it is 32 and this one is uh, 48, okay. This one is 16 and this is 24. This one is 8 and this is 12. This one is 4 and this is 6. This one is 2 and this is 3. Okay. Now I can say it is product of all these. Okay. Or Mirko LCM Ajayaga. But the only problem which I get here is for doing this particular one. Okay. Mirko ye chota sa kam karne ke liye. I am 
वॉट इज ए वेस्टिंग ऑलमोस्ट फोर्टी सेकेंड्स ओके फोर्टी सेकेंड्स का टाइम ऑलमोस्ट मेरे को वेस्ट हो रहा है सो टू अवॉइड दिस ओके टू अवॉइड दिस वी कैन अप्रोच विद दिस पर्टिक्युलर मेथड ओके विच आई सेट नाउ लेट्स ए सिक्सटी फोर एंड नाइन्टी सिक्स आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट ओके नाउ आई विल सी if 96 is able to divide this okay is 96 able to divide this no multiply 96 by 2 i will get it as 192 is 92 able to divide this 64 64 64 is equal to 192 okay so i can say 192 is the lcm see there are some of the questions okay in aptitude where i have to deal with lcms okay mereko lcm se deal karna padega and when i have to deal with lcm the questions are actually designed in such a way ki aapko jyada calculative na ho you have to be logical okay the questions are also designed in that way only okay see the paper setter okay wo log aise hi question nahi denge they will not randomly give you the numbers they will give it in such a way that you are able to solve it by using some logic to so, agar aapko aise logic malum hai then you can solve it in a faster way okay now i am not saying that this method is bad ye acha method hai okay it's a very reliable method okay but then it will take time because you are writing a lot okay here so so when i am doing something like this mai actually question ko dekh ke okay from the question itself i can just think ki ye to divide nahi ho raha hai to multiply by 2 karunga to hoga ki nahi so i will make that estimation okay so it will save a lot of time for me All right. So LCM ka to introduction yehi tha. Okay. Um, let's talk about HCF also. We'll see two methods for HCF also. So if I am talking about the HCF of 32 uh, and 48, let's say. Okay. Or else, ah, uh, 48 le lete hain. Okay. So what is the HCF of 32 and 48? So what i can do is i can write this one as 2 power 5 32 can be written as 2 power 5 this one i can write it as 2 into 24 then 4 into 12 then 8 into 6 okay then 16 into 3 so 16 can be written as 2 power 4 into 3 okay 16 can be written as 2 power 4 so this can be written as 2 power 4 into 3 so i can say in these two what is common in these two 2 power 4 is common yahan pe aur yahan pe 2 power 4 is common so i can say this is the hcf okay which is the highest common factor the highest common factor is 2 power 4 okay now for this one there is another method okay there is another method I can say, मैं थर्टी टू और फोर्टी एट को यही पे लिख सकता हूँ एक्चुअली ये भी एक मेथड है वेर आई राइट इट एज सिक्सटीन एंड ट्वेंटी फोर एंड दिस वन इज एट एंड ट्वेल्व दिस वन इज फोर एंड सिक्स दिस वन इज वॉट यू से टू एंड थ्री नाउ विल देर बी एनी थिंग कॉमन हियर यहाँ पे और कुछ कॉमन होगा क्या नहीं होगा सो आई विल जस्ट स्टॉप हियर and this one 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 16 will be the answer now for what you say for hcf this is a better method lcm ke liye ye itna better method nahi hai lekin for hcf it is a better method kyunki dono mein common hone ka jo chances hai wo bahut kam rehta hai in this case it was more okay but dono mein jo common rehne ka chances hai okay that will be little less did you all get this one now if i am talking about lcm of these two if i am talking about lcm of these two okay not hcf lcm of these two how will i do it i will multiply this one by 2 because i will see if uh, 48 is able to divide 32 no i will multiply this one by 2 it will become 96 is 96 able to divide 32 yes it is three times so i can say 96 is the lcm now just see here LCM is 96, HCF is 16. Okay, and the product of these two, the product of these two is 32 into 48. You will find the product of these two will be equal to the product of LCM and HCF. 
okay will be equal to the product of lcm and hcf okay so uh, i will just show you here again 32 into 48 the product of these two numbers will be equal to lcm which is 96 into 60 okay chahiye to aap ek bar dekh lo this goes three times 32 into 3 is equal to 96 right so this is one method in which we can uh, solve the questions okay which is knowing that lcm into hcf is equal to uh, product of two numbers now why am i saying that this would be a good method is because aapko samjata hu, okay see every uh, every concept Seekhna zaruri nahi hai, apply karna baut important hai, okay. So, if I want the LCM of, let's say, uh, 32 and 48, okay, 32 and 48. Now, let's say I know that HCF of these two is equal to 16. If I am good with, what you say, taking the HCF, if I am good with taking the HCF, what I will do is, I know that HCF is equal to 16, okay, and I want to find what is LCM. So LCM will be equal to product of these two 32 into 48 divided by HCF which is equal to 16 okay because I know that LCM into HCF is equal to product of two numbers now this goes three times 32 into 3 will become 96 now if I am good with LCM let's say okay 32 and 48 I am good with taking the LCM because I can do it directly multiplied by 2 I would say 96 can divide this so I can say 96 is the LCM here so product of these two divide by LCM okay will give me HCF 16 will be the HCF. So this is one important formula or is formula say both are question solve hote. and what is the formula LCM into HCF will be equal to HCF is equal to product of two numbers. I will write it as A into B which is a product of two numbers right now in the next what you say uh, session we will see what are the techniques okay what are the techniques of solving lcm and hcf questions kyunki hamesha aise straight questions nahi aate hai na okay see this this particular thing which i told you you can use it as a concept for solving some of the topics or uh, where lcm and hcf is required for example if you are doing time and work time speed distance you need to take lot many lcms okay aapko bahut sara lcm lena padega wahan pe us time pe aap ye sab use kar sakte okay lekin directly question bahut kam Asa milega ki directly they are asking you what is the LCM and HCF. Okay. So uh, in the next session we are going to see some of the concepts also. Alright. So thank you so much guys. We'll meet in the next session.